Prince Harry was pictured with thicker, than, usual hair earlier this week, leaving fans wondering how the prince's locks have transformed. The Duke of Sussex typically has thinning hair at the top of his head, but a photograph published on his profile page on the company page of the start, up shows thick and dark locks. Pictures from a week earlier, while he played polo in Singapore, showed his hair usually looks much thinner. Hair was a hot topic for Harry. At the beginning of this year after he described Prince William's hair loss as alarming in his controversial autobiography, Spare. Despite the two-year age gap, William's hair loss was more advanced than mine, he claimed. In 2021 Dr. Asim Shah Malak, a leading cosmetic surgeon from the UK, claimed Harry's hair loss had accelerated since he moved to the States with Meghan, and predicted baldness by the age of 50. But he also said Harry is balding slower than Prince William, and is a strong 10 years behind his older brother in terms of hair loss. For all the latest on news, politics, sports, and showbiz from the USA, go to the Mirror US. But now, Spencer Stevenson, founder of Spex Hair, a leading hair loss and hair transplant advisor, has revealed the wonder product that Harry is very likely to be using to achieve his new voluminous look. He told The Sun, I think Harry's hair shows signs of being helped as it looks darker and thicker. I think it's very likely he is using nanogen hair fibers. This is an A. List celeb secret and helps many when they need to thicken their hair up instantly for a photo shoot or a movie, he added before explaining that the spray on hair is used for events and shoots. The brand claims that nanogen keratin fibers merge perfectly with your own hair using electrostatic charge to give instant, natural and durable hair thickness which lasts all day. You can pick up nanogen fiber spray for as little as $40 from Amazon. At 36 years old, Harry's head of hair was as thick as Williams at 26 years old, Dr. Shamalak stated. He said, the baldness gene is not as strong in Harry but he is still losing his hair quickly. At present most of Harry's hair loss is around the crown area. He has a growing bald patch right across his crown and you can also see that his hair is also thinning out towards the front. Without treatment, the acceleration we have seen over the last 15 months will only increase over the next year. Harry may never be as bald as his brother William. William has been more affected than any of the royal men.